Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Indie 500 project. Today's experiment, Insanely Twisted Shadow Planet. It's a little tricky because it's developed by Shadow Planet Productions, but it's published by Microsoft Game Studios. And I do believe that this was an Xbox tile for uh, Xbox Arcade tile for the first time around. And I am not sure how the funding for this game was uh, came to life. If it was just uh, developed by Shadow Planet and then sold to Microsoft, or if Microsoft actually pushed money into the project. But it's it's listed as an indie title and many people will claim it as an indie title so it's an indie title so far i will see if we can get a clear sense of of the actual definition for this game at a later time but right now let's see what the game has to say about itself in this insanely twisted 2d action adventure game explore unique environments and battle bizarre creature as you make your way towards the center of the mysterious shadow planet Solve complex puzzles and upgrade your ship with alien technology as you fight to save your home world. Featuring both local and Games for Windows Live multiplayer game modes. But we're not doing multiplayer games, we're doing single player games at the moment. And let's just run the campaign and see what this game has to offer. And this game offers intro cinematics that will not be recorded, so we skip those. And that is a saucer. All the right one to display inventory. This is the inventory. Right stick to select. Saucer. Release to equip. Ah, oh, it's a... Okay. Right trigger to activate. Yes. Tools. I'm guessing that's a tool. Yes. Left stick to move. We can move around and we can activate that thing. And that unlocked something over here. And that unlocked something else. Is that it? We unlocked the platform we started out from. This, this is progress, ladies and gentlemen. We are m progressing towards what we began with. And another cinematic later, we are witnessing a shooting star. Okay. Oops. I'm using a 360 controller, that's why the 360 controller sh uh, control schemes are showing up in all the key hints. And we are supposed to go that way, but if uh, we have learned anything from video games, it's let's explore first. It's... I know this is a 2D game, but I'm wondering how this place looks in 3D. Like, this, these looks like cogs that are just rolling around. Can I just, just sidestep them? <laughs> Apparently nothing up here. Apparently nothing up there. Do do. Scanning, let's go with them. Hey, buddy. Ah. I need something. They're doing something. These scans aren't telling me much though. Map updated. Ah, I need to go there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> ah. Looks like I'll be hunting down a laser rifle. Or laser. I'm not sure that qualifies as a, as a rifle when it will be mounted on my spaceship, but a laser. Now, where are we going? Ah! Do not go into the light! Okay, let's not go into the light. Let's go somewhere else. Will that hurt me? No, it will just bump me around. Whoa! Airstreams! Okay, so those weren't lights. Those were airstreams. Where am I? I appear to be in the correct passage. I did not want to go to the first passage because that was a dead end. I did not want to go to the second passage because that was a dead end. And let's keep 
going? Can I scan that thing? Wow! Okay, now going back. Oh, he knocked it free for me. How thoughtful. You may assign hotkeys to as many tools as in the... Okay, how do I assign hotkeys? Right button. Oh, I can assign... Okay. Face buttons. We want that thing. We want A and that... No, we want that thing to shoot and we want that thing to scan. Should be all good. Kee-wee-pew! Taste my lasers! Destination, we want to go there, which means we have to traverse this, 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 and this. Which means we have to go down there. Let's go down there first. Can I shoot you guys? I cannot shoot you guys. Anyways, we want to go down here. Red usually means danger, but I'm not sensing much danger from these things. I take it these are checkpoints. Alright, fellas, where are we going? Whoa, those things are dangerous, apparently. So what differentiates the ones that are stuck to the ones that are floating around? Ah, health. Not that I need it, but it's health. Oh. Mm. We are learning things. We are learning that we can shoot things. Ah. Hey, no dodging. Dodging is unfair. Only I may dodge. Is that thing alive? I can't scan it, so I'm guessing not. It's just moving around for whatever reason. <laughs> moving the little rocks. How did he get down here, by the way? Because the passage was cut off. Oh god, alright. Ah! Wow, and they regrow as well. Okay, good to know, good to know. Well, these things regrow as well, so it's all balances out. I'm not any less reasonable than that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. All right, how did he get down here? Because we had to open up those tentacles, and we had a patrol with us that. Whoa. Ah! No! No, buddy! Ah, I have a grappling arm. Silent. I'm gonna save you with your own grappling arm. If I can hang on to things. I cannot hang on to those things. I can hang on to this. Why can't I hang on to those? I... Let's give him a proper burial, at least. Yeah. Okay, I'm guessing we're gonna do this. Grab a hold of that. Ah! Whoa! I am smoking, and not in a good way. along and saves the day. Mm -hmm. I want to go where he went. I want to be with my friends. 
Which apparently is too much to ask. Wow. Scan those things. Whoa, I am not looking well. Ah, oh, we can do this. Ah, uh, try and shoot me now. Health, health, health. There we go. Let's bring out the lasers. I think we just discovered a physics puzzle. Mm-hmm. And we want to shoot those things. Right on. Want to grab this thing, put it down here. Want to pull this thing. Oh, can we pull it? No, we can't pull it all the way up. And well, then we hurry. And then we... Ah, shoot it, shoot it! There we go. Checkpoint. Oh, checkpoint heals me. Nice, nice. Good to know, good to know. We are out. Yes, we're supposed to go that way, but let's go this way first. Yeah. Do do do. Pew, 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 pew. Ah, more tentacles. But we grow very fast. Let's just keep shooting downwards and let's go downwards. Damn. You, let's shoot you. I'm guessing that I'm gonna have to grab this one before he bites me. And another cutscene later. We are in a new place. We want to go that way. Exploring ah, buttons. What do we have over here? We have a rock that we can pick up. That thing apparently hurts. Let's shoot it. Mm-hmm. Oh, he leaves health. A very kind of him. Can go in there? Nope. Hmm. Full health. And upstairs. Another one of those. And nowhere to go. Okay, let's. Hmm. There's appears to be only one way to go. Whoa. Scans. That's a little lizard thing with uh, like a house on his back, kind of like a snail. Yeah. I'm guessing. <laughs> uh, I gotta feed the big tentacles with the small little lizards. Come on, open up. There you go. I don't have any lizards left. You will have to settle for a rock. Whoa, it worked. Cool. Their diet is questionable. Aesthetics. The silhouette-like game is, or, or design is very nicely done. Like the small touches of color that appears here and there are... Mm, can I throw rocks at him? Yes, but it didn't do anything. Uh, it gives the aesthetics a really nice touch. And the audio is... Kind of like how I would want it. Like how the saucer sounds like, like wee and all that stuff. Why am I smoking? I should not be smoking. I should not be smoking. It is bad for my health. Dead end, really? 
All right. Uh, let's scan for intelligent life. We found a rock. That is the most intelligent life there is around here, apparently. Lizards. Let's go with lizard. Let's feed lizards to the alien tentacle thingies. Checkpoint, still smoking. Not happy about that. The controls are really responsive. It's acting the exact same way that I was kind of hoping that it would. Like how you control the saucer, how you control the arms. The physics could use a bit of a touch up because like, I really would like to be able to throw this thing. Maybe do some damage to something. Spores, let's scan the spores. Oh, I can touch, pick up the spores. Ha. Still no throwing. Sound design is uh, actually a little bit scary. Wow. I am feeling very lonely, and that's a good thing. I guess. I need health, not enemies. Ah! More not health. Where is health? Where am I going? Uh, let's check out this area first. Health, give me health, health. I am, whoa. That's a... Uh, one or three pieces of... Mm. Okay. Secrets of some sort. Why am I still smoking? I should not be smoking. Still very bad for my health. Is there a non-smoking patch somewhere? Quit smoking patch. Or... Hmm. Why is everything looking so ominous? Yes. The aiming is a little bit awkward as well. I'm having a hard time finding the exact aim. It's like you steer with one thumbstick and you aim with the next. And it's not really the way I would like it. I don't know if it's too accurate or not accurate enough. Let's see if we shoot downwards. And yeah, we can hit almost every angle, so I'm guessing it's too accurate. Compared to what I'm used to, actually. I mean, it's a good thing that you can shoot in the exact angle that you wish. But I'm currently not it's not working out right now. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Stop it, stop it. Get over here and die. Wee 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 and checkpoint. Things are looking more and more ominous, and that is not a good thing. I mean if they want to go for something like a Metroidvania vibe, it's actually kind of working. Oh, so you're eating those. Am I supposed to feed you with those? Nope. Stop it. Die. Not helping, not helping. Upgrade. Ah, double shot. I'm gonna kill him now. Nope, apparently not. St 
still no killing the big ones. Ah, it's got a long tongue. Yes, eat those things. Those things are much tastier than I am. Ah! Stop it! Where am I going? I'm going that way. Yes, eat those things. Like I said, stop. This is no bueno. This is no bueno at all. Ah, there we go. Yes, yes. Now we're bueno. And the game crashed. So I'm guessing that's insanely twisted shadow plan for you, ladies and gentlemen. Until next time, happy gaming. And that is a saucer. All the right one to display inventory. This is the inventory. Right stick to select. Saucer. Release to equip. Ah, oh, it's a... Uh, okay. Right trigger to activate. Yes. Tools. I Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Indy 500 project. Today's experiment. Insanely Twisted Shadow Planet. It's a little tricky because it's developed by Shadow Planet Productions, but it's published by Microsoft Game Studios. And I do believe that this was an Xbox tile for uh, Xbox Arcade tile for the first time around. And I am not sure how the funding for this game was uh, came to life if it was just uh, developed by Shadow Planet and then sold to Microsoft or if Microsoft actually pushed money into the project. But it's it's listed as an indie title and many people will claim it as an indie title so it's an indie title so far i will see if we can get a clear sense of of the actual definition for this game at a later time but right now let's see what the game has to say about itself in this insanely twisted 2d action adventure game explore unique environments and battle bizarre creature as you make your way towards the center of the mysterious shadow planet Solve complex puzzles and upgrade your ship with alien technology as you fight to save your home world. Featuring both local and games for Windows Live multiplayer game modes. But we're not doing multiplayer games, we're doing single player games at the moment. And let's just run the campaign and see what this game has to offer. And this game offers intro cinematics that will not be recorded. So we skip those. <laughs> 